Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today's a story time. So, like, comment, subscribe if you feel like it. It's your choice. And enjoy the video. So, as many of you know, there's something called the Howl Plaque. It is right over here. And, as fewer people know, it is no longer available. But, since I've been playing for a long time, and I'm a very old jammer, let's say, to say the least, honestly, um, so this account is actually only two years old, but I have older ones. So, you know, I'm going to tell you about the time I won the Howl Plaque. So, I was nine years old, I know, ancient history, but, um, so, me and my friend, let's call her Mergie. Um, it's nothing close to her real name, but, so let's call her that. So, Mergie had been playing here much of forever and introduced me. safer internet plaque or whatever it's called. Um, so I went and got that, but then I wanted more plaques. So I decided I'd start to do stuff. So there's these things called howls, and I'm at sleepover with her. We stayed up late doing howls, but nothing came in. So I decided to write my own one, and what we've been writing was like a wolf howls. So I wrote, Animal Jam is awesome, Animal Jam is cool, you know, blah blah blah. Some weird haiku. But, um, I sent it in, see it in Jam Essential, so I thought, oh, it was just another one. And it was. Ha, oh, I tricked you. Ha, oh, I tricked you. Yeah, it was just another one, and it didn't go through. So I did a lot of more, where I inserted, and I sent in my art, and then I got the artist plaque, and I was very, very excited about that, because if you don't know, I am not an artist at all. Just, just for reference, I'll show you some of my art. So, as you can see, I'm not really an artist. But, however, I thought I was at the time, because I was nine, and I was so cool at school because everybody was into Animal Jam. And honestly, a lot of kids in my class still are, and they're too old for it, but we don't care. But, um, so everybody's into it, and I was so cool because I had an artist plaque, even though my art sucks, and I don't know why it, it won or anything. But anyways, so I have the old plaques, so they're going up in value, actually, because I don't have the diamond plaques. But honestly, I'd rather have the diamond plaques, because that makes me feel special. <laughs> but, um, so, I sent him howls every day, because it was just an easy thing to do, right? Someday I get a jamogram, and I just think, oh, it's AJ Box. Well, actually, I didn't have AJ Box back then, so um, I'm like, oh, it's just one of my buddies jacking me something weird, because that happened a lot to me back then. Um, let's see if I can find one.
so you can see, um, my AJ life is pretty weird, to be honest. Um, but, so, you know, I felt very, very proud. And I wanted more plaques. More, more, more. So I tried to get epic dens, but my dens back then suck, and they still sort of do. Except for my lucky den, like my one good den. And I only get to use it for one month, so it's a disappointment. But anyways, so, to carry on, I felt so proud. I've said that like so many times, but no. So I kept sending in plaques, and I think AJ just got annoyed, because this is literally what my plaque said. I mean, the how. So yeah, I think AJ just got tired of hearing me just send in these desperate little plaques for a little, you know, just because I'm so awesome. But anyways, I got this plaque, and I am, like, exploding with pride, and like, a year later, nobody cares about plaques, and I'm just that weird kid for playing Animal Jam. So, you know, that's how life is. One day, you're on top of the world, and the next day, you're just... You're the weird kid who still plays a kid's game.